To zoom in and out on an embroidery design, especially if you want to be able to position it, align with other designs, or when we'll do design positioning. So when you touch the picture of the magnifying glass, zoom options comes up. So zoom to all means you're going to get the design as big as it possibly can on your screen here. Next, zoom to hoop. So if you have a hoop on your screen, it's going to show you those outside boundaries, letting you see all your available embroidery area at once. Now, another thing that you can do that I love is zoom to box. So any of you who have been using a computer, you know that if you kind of click and drag around an area, you'll zoom in on the box that you create. So if I want to see the center of this flower, if I touch my stylus, to the screen and I'm holding it and I'm dragging a box around the flower, then it will zoom right to that flower with that being right where I want it to be. So instead of zooming in, which this is the other place you can do it, you can do plus or minus, but it will zoom in on the center of the design. Then you have to pan over and move to where you need to be. Once you're done with the area you're working with zoomed in or aligned up, the easiest way to go back is touch the zoom options and then zoom to hoop and that gets you all the way back out to where you wanna go. So another thing you can do, that plus or minus, so if I just touch it, you'll notice you'll go up increments of about 10% of the time, and you can really zoom yourself in there quite quickly. But again, if you wanna be over here in this corner, use that feature that with the zoom to box, it's gonna be a lot faster to use. We'll zoom out, zoom to hoop, so it's easy to go in and out to see an area of a design that you might want to connect another design to. For example, you can see that this would be really pretty if you did it one after another and you want to find a place that really kind of connects each other for the, in the design position. So check out that video and we'll use the zoom options quite a bit.